hello everyone and welcome back so you can see that I have created all the images and I, I have put them in the correct places according to the size which Apple actually wants from us so now we will run the app and see how this looks now our simulator will start this is our launch screen that you will see whenever our app is first launched and then it will automatically go away within two or three seconds and this is our app so what I will do is I will close the app by pressing command shift and H twice so you can see that this, this is my app so I will just close it like this and I will press this so you can see that uh, this is our iOS sim simulator in which all our apps are there so these are all the apps which do not have any icon but here you can see that this is our app which has a icon just we have which we have just created this is our sample icon you can see that and it is the same that we have just created so iOS will automatically take the different size images as it wants it is an iOS 8 iOS 10 image for iPhone 6s so I think it is 80 pixels so it will adjust automatically according to the iPhone or iPad that we are working with so I will again launch this app you can see that this was a small pop-up of our launch screen which remains for one or two seconds so this was about launch screens and uh, app icons in iOS so basically app icons are very important because if you want to publish your app then you need all different sizes of app icons and if you have not if you don't have them then apple would not allow you to publish your apps in the app store so this is it thank you for watching this video